all right what's going on guap chasers i'm back with another video and in this video i'm going to be explaining to you guys the differences between the crescent's perfect aim edition script and the crescent's aim correction script but before we get into all that i just want to say merry christmas to everybody i know that date that you guys are going to be seeing this is going to be the 23rd but however i also know that the 24th and the 25th is pretty much family time for almost everybody so it's no it's not going to be any time for probably youtube if so it is what it is but i know for most people it's not in the schedule but i just wanted to get that get that out there also don't forget to subscribe to the channel turn on that post notification bell icon so you know when to upload any new video to this channel and also don't forget to smash that like button i also have a discord link in the description if you need any cronus strike pack uh help questions comments concerns go ahead and hit that link in the description below and join us we got plenty of members in the community to help you with anything so first things first i'm going to tell you guys what script that i was using in this video and every link will be in the description below for both of the scripts that i'm talking about in this video so in this video i was using the aim correction script and basically the, what the aim correction script is is basically or what it does it basically adjusts your recoil for you and when i what i mean when i say that is let's just say you go into a private match and you try to adjust this recoil so you're shooting at the wall your aim is still going to go up and that is because this script is basically set on moving objects basically targets another person in this game so if you shoot at a wall that's not a target um that's just the wall so of course your recoil is going to go up but if you're aiming at a target it will stick to that target so basically it would adjust the recoil for you without you doing anything at all and that's what i like about this script however this script also doesn't have a lot of mods i think the only mods that it has is rapid fire and it was another one i'm not really sure but i should have um, researched this before i did this little video but i'm going off the top of my head also so but it doesn't come with a lot of mods and that's the only thing about this but it also is in a beta stage so you can't really judge that right now until he comes out with the full product of this script so that's that now you know i gotta plug it in so if you got this far into this video don't forget to uh go in and post any type of emoji below muscle emoji fire emoji bomb emoji you know i like saying that so just go ahead and drop them emoji below for me you know now we're gonna keep it going now we're gonna talk about the perfect aim edition script as you guys know that script you can adjust the recoil manually by going into a private match shooting at the wall and doing all of that and it also has four different profiles that you can do it for four different guns that is a plus you know i like that but it's also time consuming so you got to think about everything is just time consuming if you don't got a lot of time on your hands i would suggest you go with the aim correction so you can just hurry and play you know what i'm saying you can just hurry and get right in the game uh, you can adjust the strength, you can adjust the, uh, you know, the strength, increase it, decrease it, and stuff like that. Now, if you're playing with the perfect aim edition script, you got to go into a private match. You got to uh, sit there and shoot at the wall for each different profile, set up all the guns. However, that script does have triple sticky aim, rapid fire, uh, the four different profiles, and just a ton of stuff. Like I said, I'm going to leave each link in the description below so you guys can go ahead and do your research from both of them and to be honest both of them are excellent scripts i'm talking about 10 out of 10 scripts i give it matter of fact i give it a more than a 10 i give it a 20 20 you know what i'm saying both of them they are excellent scripts i will prefer anybody that plays black ops modern warfare to use these scripts because you can actually feel your aim sticking on the target. However how you got it, you can feel it sticking. And that's what I like about it. It's not no slow dragging script. It's like real sticky fast. You know what I'm saying? 
So that's basically it. And it's been like a long time since I played Modern Warfare also. Ever since Black Ops Cold War came out, I, I decided to hit y'all with something different in this video, you know, give it a different feeling than, you know, Black Ops. I know that was getting watered down and stuff like that, so I decided to hit y'all with something different. But I ain't gonna talk over probably the rest of this video because I feel like I said enough already and I, you know, let y'all finish watching this video like I always do. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel, turn on that post notification bell icon, and also smash that like button. Drop them emojis below also. Please, any type of emoji, just drop them, you know. Y'all rocking with me, I'm rocking with y'all. Like I said, join that Discord link. Don't be quiet, go ahead and come out here and join the rest of the team. Talk to us, I'll talk back for the most part, but uh, see y'all in the next video. Like I said, Merry Christmas to everybody out there. And see y'all. Peace.